Good morning and welcome to the Rebel News Network. I'm Caitlin. And I'm Caitlin. And we are your hosts for today. Please join me in the Pledge of Allegiance. Ladies and gentlemen, please remove your hats. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. The CHS German Club will be going to the Christmas market on Friday, December 9th at 5 p.m. Come join us to explore the, Chris the Christmas market in downtown Denver. You can have dinner or a snack, you can sing if you'd like, play an instrument, maybe even ice skate at the Christmas market on 16th Street Mall and Arapaho Street, right next to the Daniels and Fisher Clark Tower. Come and get a permission slip and talk to Miss Bergen for more details. A few more announcements are coming up. Good morning, Columbine! Christy here with today's Christy 60. All right, half the house award this week goes to John Glau. I hope I'm saying that correctly. John Glau, he is number two on the Rebel Pride leaderboard app. John, come and see me. You are packed at the house. Great job. He's, like I said, number two on the Rebel leaderboard app. Now, number one is Ellie Barrows. If you want to catch Ellie, now is the time. She's playing basketball. She can't be at everything like she's been, like she, she did in the fall. Now is the time to make your move on her. She can't be at everything. You can be, though. Catch up to Ellie. You can catch Ellie. I'm moving in, too. I, I've been remembering to, to check in. I'm moving up that board. You should be move, moving up the board as well. All right? Pack the house award once again. Congratulations, John Glau. Come and see me. You are packing the house. Continue to do so. Speaking of the Rebel Pride app, we are almost at 500 users. Once we hit 500, we get another prize. We get another prize. All right, so make sure if you have not registered for the Rebel Pride app, get it, download it today, get registered, get on there. You got some great prizes. And you know what? It's all about packing the house. Pack the house. All right, shout outs this week. We got a bunch of rep winter sports. Really like our winter sports teams. They are working very hard. Got some really tough teams. Uh, girls basketball. Girls basketball. The Rebels with a with a cause a tournament last week hosted right here at Columbine. Girls take two out of three games, win big. In the third one, very close game, uh, but they are looking very strong. Girls basketball. Shout out to you guys. Boys basketball gets their first win of the season. First game, first win, and it's a big one over Abraham Lincoln High School. Great job, boys basketball. Wrestling, Tim Mullen this weekend takes second place in his weight classification over at the Arapaho Invitational. Great job, Tim. Wrestling's looking strong as well. Schedule for the week. Wednesday, we have basketball, we have wrestling. Okay, basketball, we got the girls here taking on Gateway. It's a blackout. Boys are at Gateway, same day. And the wrestling team is at Pomona taking on the defending state champs. Pomona, uh, that's wrestling. And then we got Friday, Friday, big night. Boys, basketball is right here at Columbine, 7 o'clock. They're taking on Heritage. That's also a blackout. Um, and we also have a special, very special halftime recognition. Make sure you're there. Pack the house for boys basketball. The girls, it's over at Heritage, so not far from here. Like I said, girls basketball looking very strong. Um, and then Saturday, all day, we have the Rebel uh, Wrestling Tournament right here in the gym. That'll go on all day. Come over on Saturday and cheer on our wrestlers. That's it for now, Rebels. Great job. Continue to pack the house. And thank you for making Columbine what it is, which is the best school on the planet. Have a great one. Would you like to live and attend school in Australia for six months? Have you ever considered traveling or living in a foreign country as an exchange student? Learning a new culture and meeting new friends? Because that sounds like a fun time. Lakewood Sister Cities program has an Australian student exchange program to all Jefferson County High School freshmen and sophomores. An informational meeting about the program will take place on Thursday, December 8th from 7 to 8 p.m. at the Lakewood Cultural Center. For more information, contact your counselor and come to the informational meeting. Applications are due February 3rd, um, and I believe that's it. So thank, thank you, Rebels, Rebels, and good, good morning, morning to you. To you.